Okay, hi, thanks for watching today, and I hope you like my props, because what I did was put this on so that you will know we're actually going to talk about injured athletes, and we're going to talk about high-performing athletes that are trying to get a competitive advantage. And that's what our functional restoration program is about, where we use our Infrex FRM and our Infrex Plus units. Basically, what we're discussing is anytime you have an athlete, if you're injured, obviously the first thing, or you're sore from competing, one of the things you want to do is become restore the function that you had without the pain, without the soreness, or you had before you had your injury. So what we always try to do is functional restoration is to get you back to where you were if you've been in an injured status. If you're not in an injured status, but you're simply trying to increase your competitive edge to have an advantage to be able to beat the person that you're competing against, then that's also what our functional restoration program is. And what it boils down to is like, example, if you're out with a, playing tennis, say you are a very good tennis player. If you can simply develop more power quicker in your backhand, if you can set up quicker, then that gives you a little, if quicker than your opponent, that gives you an advantage. If you can increase your range of motion, you can extend a little farther. Let's say the extension, and I'm just using it as a number, let's say the extension to get ready for your, for your forehand would normally be 170 degrees. But let's say we can help you go from 170 up to 179 degrees, and we can do it consistently to help you. Anytime you increase that range, you also increase the opportunity to create more force. And when you create more force, you have an advantage when the ball reaches the racket, more force, you can get it over quicker, you can set up quicker, you have an advantage. That's what functional restoration is about. We are literally trying to work with you using a series of exercises, and then we supplement that with the use of electrical stem, that Infrex unit, and we have you work together. Now, the advantage we get is by using this program and exercising properly, not repetitively, properly, we are actually gaining strength. We're gaining quickness, and it is coming from having the nerve bundles that control our muscles, exciting them at the moment you're trying to excite them, and the repetition of an external electrical stimulus to your volitional movement to get better is what will make the difference. That's where you gain the competitive advantage. Now, I'll show you when you in the video, you'll see this little thing where you'll see me actually hitting with a club. What I want to show you on that is how if you can extend your ability to turn, that's range of motion, and you can make it come down quicker, then what's going to happen is you are actually going to be able to increase the distance. Hopefully you will keep the control there, but that's part of exercising properly. And as you exercise properly and you maintain it, you're actually developing the ability to move quicker with more force or torque. And as a result of that, you should be able to gain a competitive advantage. What I'm trying to show you here is if you're a golfer, and we were talking about functional restoration, what I was pointing out was if you're getting ready to hit the ball and your range of motion is only to here, pow, you've only got so much room to create the force. Now, we want to facilitate as quick as we can those motor nerves that create force. But another way to create more force is to extend your range of motion. Instead of going here, and that's as far as you can go, we work with you to go back and then come through. If you can extend that range, that's where it comes from. Now, a quickie for you, just so you know. For many of you, I used to golf like two to three times a month. And right after my son was born, I said, you know what, this is taking too long. I need to be at home on Saturdays instead of doing it. So I quit golfing for about 16, 18 years. And then I went back after 16, 18 years and everybody was gulking at me. And I said, gosh, am I that bad? 
What it actually was, was for many of you, this is called a wood. <laughs> And today, titanium clubs and everything else has replaced woods. But this was the standard years ago. And what people were gawking at is in my bag, they saw all these unusual clubs standing up. They had never seen a wood. Of course, I've had plenty of people tell me, say, Bob, you know, if you would go to a titanium, titanium uh, driver, you'd probably increase your distance by 20 yards or so based upon how far you're heading. Well, when you only golf once or twice a year, there's no way I'm going to pay $260 for one club just to go 20 yards, and I hope it's in the right direction. But out of the video, at least you see, this is what a wood looks like. Okay, what we're talking about tennis, you set up, you pull back, you're ready to hit. First thing we want to do, functional restoration, move quicker, get ready. Next thing we want to do is deliver the force. The way we do it is we activate you working with us volitionally trying to do this. We're going to use some electric stem. We're going to get you doing it correctly, but we're going to get you doing it quicker with more force. That's what functional restoration is about when you're an athlete. Thanks for watching.